now we'll see common problems so we'll see how prob how different types of problems uh, are faced while we perform this uh, tlc now stationary phase you know since uh, length of the stationary phase is limited in tlc there may be limited separation as compared with other types of methods we we, we know that uh, there is proper there is definite length of the stationary phase and that depends on the length of the plate and similarly there is a small thickness of the stationary phase on the plate so chuki uski thickness bhi kam hoti hai aur uske alawa uski jo length hai wo bhi kam hoti hai so accordingly jo separation hoti hai zahir wo effect karti hai since there is thin layer of stationary phase on the plate so it may not be able to withstand high temperature which is required for the separation sometime we have to heat up our you know uh, mixture so that its components may be separated yahan jab aap usko heat up karte hain to jo stationary phase ho sakti hai jo ek thin plate ki form mein hoti hai that may be damaged so that's why there is problem uh, while we perform this tlc similarly strong acids and oxidizing uh, stains may also damage the stationary phase so we have to uh, we have to use our stationary phase according to sample uh, and we also have to adjust our uh, you know mobile phase kyunki agar usme strong acids honge agar usme oxidizing stains jo hum baad mein use karte hain wo hum use karenge so that may damage the stationary phase so zahir ye bhi hame problem face karna pad sakta hai similarly there may be problems of contamination during processing and handling of the tlc plates uh, manually agar hum tlc plates ko uh, usme chamber mein rakhenge ya wahan se remove karenge to hame pata hai ki hamare fingertips ke upar different uh, compounds organic compounds hote hain amino acids ke form mein jo aur compounds hote hain wo wahan unke spots ban jate hain plates ke upar aur is tarah se wahan hame contamination ke jo masail hain wo face karna pad sakte hain so the uh, these are the problems which may be due to stationary phase now mobile phase a uh, mobile phase which travel through capillary action on the uh, stationary phase on the tlc plate that you know may advance that may travel with uneven flow on the plate so it may have you know uneven uh, flow rate on the plate and this may lead to inaccurate rf values zahir hai kisi jagah agar plate mein uska distance zyada hoga kisi jagah uska distance kam hoga to hum zahir hai jo mobile phase ka jo distance hoga wo phir hum accurate measure nahi kar sakte hain aur isliye hame accurate rf values hoti hain wo nahi milti hain and how it may be avoided it may be avoided by placing tlc plates exactly vertical without any contact so jo tlc plates hum solvent mein rakhte hain chamber mein rakhte hain वो टिल्ट करके किसी स्पोर्ट के ऊपर नहीं रखनी चाहिए स्ट्रेट होनी चाहिए वर्टिकल पोजीशन में होनी चाहिए और उनके साथ कोई चीज़ टच नहीं करनी चाहिए कि जिसके साथ जो मोबाइल फेस का जो फ्लो होता है वो अफेक्ट हो और इस तरह हमें प्रॉब्लम बाद में फेस करने पड़ सकते हैं दे शुड बी इनफ सालमेंट सो डेट इट कैन ट्रेवल अप टू मोस्ट ऑफ द लेंथ ऑफ द प्लेट सो एक तो हमने डिस्कस किया कि जो स्पॉट्स होते हैं दे शुड बी अप्लाइड अब द level of the solvent but at the same time your solvent hota hai that should not be uh, you know in small amount uh, agar wo bahut thodi amount mein hoga to then it may not travel up to the whole length of the plate so we should have enough amount of the uh, solvent or the mobile phase tlc plate should be cut evenly for the separation zahir hai usme कट्स अन इवन नहीं होने चाहिए अगर कट्स अवन अन इवन होंगे उसकी वजह से जो सॉल्वेंट है जाहिर इसका जो एडवांस इसकी होगी इसकी जो मूवमेंट होगी वो भी अन इवन हो सकती है सो डेट्स वाई इट हैज टू बी कट इवनली फॉर द सेपरेशन एंड चॉइस ऑफ सूटेबल सॉल्वेंट सिस्टम इज वेरी क्रिटिकल वी हैव डिस्कस्ड ऑलरेडी दैट मिक्स कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ अ मिक्सचर दे आर सेपरेटेड अकॉर्डिंग टू 
their affinities with the mobile phase. So, just like a sample hoga, uske accordingly, we mobile phase jo wo use karna padti hai, aur is tarah se zahir hai, uh, separation jo hai, wo hum behtar taur pe kar sakte hai. Now, streaking, we know that uh, when we apply spots on the TLC plate, these uh, spots should be separate from each other, so that we have separate separation from those spots. If they are creep-creep, their spots can mix up and we can a problem. Similarly, we should not have concentrated samples. Uh, the very concentrated samples when we use them, the capillary action is the travel on the, on the TLC plates. Wo uh, slow hota hai, utra efficient nahi ho sakta. So concentrated samples may lead to streaks instead of isol isolate spots on the plates. So we should use, uh, you know, appropriate suitable sample which should neither be very concentrated nor they should be very dilute. Uh, this may, uh, this is due to that limited separation by the mobile phase takes place if the samples they are really concentrated. Zahare, unki separation utni efficient, utni better nahi hoti. And this may be avoided by diluting the sample uh, for the better separation, for the better dilution. Samples should be applied above the solvent level. Hamne pehle bhi isko discuss kiya. And two big spots of samples on the TLC plate may also lead to inadequate separation. So, the, the spots, they should not be too big, they should not be even too small. So, we should have, uh, you know, good uh, amount of, or good size of the spots. Samples, they should be spotted with care, so that we have separate spots for different mixtures, so that they can be separated. Zahir hai, ye jo spots hote hain, yehi baad mein separate hoke, different spots ki form mein, different components ki form mein, TLC plates ke upar dekhe ja sakte hain aur unhi se chukke humne unki RA values ka calculate karna hoti hain agar spots proper nahi honge unka jo distance traveled hoga with reference to the distance traveled by that solvent usko mayir karna uh, munasib tarike se unka mayir nahi kiya ja sakta accordingly unki jo RA values hogi wo bhi zahir hai hum properly calculate nahi kar sakte hain unki identification mein problem aayega to is tarah uh, proper spotting is very important. If the spots are clear cut, honge, separate, honge, streaks are form, then we will not calculate their values and their identification will not be possible. Nahi so that's why streaking is very important.